Yes, up? What a do you too? What's going on? Um, everything is good. I hope everybody is doing good. I got the. I wasn't paying attention to GPS. I have to. Uh, I got to. Uh, Turn around. I know the way I can turn around. I can't do no U turn GPS, but I know a way I can turn around. I want to tell you what happened to me today, okay? I, I, was, I was going to Clearbrook. I was going to Clearbrook, Virginia. I was coming off set 70 off 81. I'm coming off set and going on 81 South. And I kind of got part in Virginia. So I was driving 65 miles per hour because the, the truck, the truck goes 63 and the gas 65 on cruise. So I was going, I see there was construction come up. And we make this U turn here. Okay. I was uh, saw the construction was coming up. So basically, what I did, I started slowing down. It was 55 miles per hour. And I got over in the right lane. So I see this cop behind me. DOT officer, right? He's behind me. He probably followed me probably between two to five miles. Got behind me, put his, put his flashes on. He said, what the fuck he put his flashes on? Okay. Here's some, here's some good old boy shit. So I pull up. I find a safe place. I pull over. He come up. Roll my window down. He said, yeah, um, you know the reason why I stopped you? I said, no. I said, I, I wonder why you did stop me. He said, well, you were doing, you were speeding at 55. I said, no, nah, no, nah, not me. He said, yeah, I was right behind you. I said, I know you were behind me. I said, why would I speed and I see you behind me? And I said, you know, it was cars passing me and the truck passed me. Well, I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about you. So right then and there, I said, okay, this little, this, this motherfucker, this good old boy here, he want to be smart. I'm not going to fall for it because I know what he trying to do. He saw a black man drive a truck, and he figured he was got me rowdy, and it would be an incident. You know, look good, for, look good for his other good old boys. So I said, oh, I, I, I said well, you, maybe you're right, maybe you're wrong. I don't know. I said, uh. He said, he said, yeah, you were doing, uh, come on, man. Yeah, you were doing 67 in the 55. I said, huh? I said, this truck can't go 67 miles per hour. Why, yeah, yo, that's what I clock. I said, I don't know how you clock that in this truck. Because this truck, this truck goes 63 miles per hour in 55 on cruise. So he got up on the truck. He saw the camera. He saw the camera. Now he know that because of the camera on and the uh, safety things and all that, they could pretty much go back and see, record, go back and see how fast I was going. He shut up then. Well, I'm gonna, I'm going to give you a level three inspection on the truck. If I don't find nothing, I'll let you go. Let's give you a warning. He, 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 he walked he, he walk in front of the truck. He walked on the back, the back of the truck. And he said, you know, everything look good, blah, 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 blah. Something, 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 he said. I, I can't, you know how these good old boys talk. And he, you know, he didn't write me a ticket. He write me a warning. Talk about the warning was
I was going speed 11 to 14 miles over the speed limit, 67 even 55 miles on. Warning. So I, I just, you know, so I just give it to my boss, you know, boss man and managers. It's almost like I want to go to court on that and say, you know, your good old boy, you know, saw a black man driving the truck, so he want to be a good old boy. And I said, you know, these trucks cannot go 67 miles per hour. You know, everybody's everybody know that. You know, so that's the incident I dealt with today that number one is this a lot of Republicans and a lot of those good old boys they don't like Jeff Bezos because Jeff Bezos he's not a Trump lover you know he don't he don't kiss Trump butt you know he don't, he don't kiss Trump butt and he uh he, he gives to the Democratic Party. Even though, you know, it's a shame that how he get rich and everybody get poor. He barely pay taxes. And right now, and I'm telling you this right now, black people, my fellow African Americans and as well brown people, you have to be careful in today's world because there's a lot of Trump good old boys out here there's a lot of Trump racist people out here that want America white again they feel like this country is made for the white man well let me tell you for people who think like that you stole this country from the Indians okay so this was not y'all country. And let me and, and let me let me give you a, a bit of history. Let me give you a little bit of history. Don't y'all know that there was a black man that put foot in America before a white man? A little history for y'all. They don't teach you in school, but you you look it up, you would definitely find out there was a black man in America before a white man took foot on America. So this is not your country. So, but you have to be careful because a lot of these good old boys out here, and you know, I don't say white people racist. I say racist white people. What the hell? There's a lot of racist white people out here. Because there's a difference between white people and racist. That's not all white people is not racist. Okay, let's get that straight. Y'all listen to that. Not all white people is racist. But you do have some racist white people out here. And I call them good old boys. And they can see you and you can do nothing. And they will do anything to provoke you. Do not follow that up. Be smart. Don't give them a reason to want to shoot you or lock you up or do other things. When that cop stopped me, you know, he, you follow me, you follow me between four to five, you know, to two to five miles. And you saw the black guy driving, and you thought you were gonna vote me. You thought, first of all, you thought you would have a ticket till you saw that camera up there, and you, you could, you know, you couldn't lie to our speed. So you thought you were gonna vote me, and I didn't follow it up. So do not follow these crazy things up. Be smart about it, people. Peace.